Hello Rich Fam! Uh, today's video is very hard to do. Uh, sa mga hindi pa po nakakaalam, my dad passed away last 22nd of October. Um, he died peacefully dito sa bahay namin and I was at his bedside all along. And birthday din niya sana nitong November 14, so it's it's like a roller coaster of emotions para sa amin. Anyway, this video is dedicated to my dad and if there's one thing about my dad is that he loves to spoil my mom. Uh, medyo malungkot yung bahay namin so I thought of putting up a Christmas tree and a few Christmas decors para kay papano naman eh ma-change yung mood ng bahay and sadly kung aalala nyo nabaharin kami around this time last year, November din yun, ng Typhoon Ulysses. And, you know, nabaharin yung Christmas decors and Christmas tree namin last year. So, it's like a series of unfortunate events. That is why I want to shake things up para naman maiba yung vibe ng mood namin or ng bahay. So, for today's video, I'm going to share some Christmas decors or some Christmas tree ornaments that I recently bought. Lahat ito ay affordable and most of them are unconventional, meaning... Sila yung mga bagay na hindi mo usually makikitang ginagamit as a Christmas decor. My mom loves anything feminine and her favorite color is the blush pink or kahit mga ganong tone. So that will be the motive of the Christmas tree that I'll be doing. Anyway, let's get started! The first one is a fake snow. This was on sale for 67 pesos per 50 grams pack. I will do a snow flocked Christmas tree this year. Kung gusto nyo malaman kung paano gumawa ng snow flocked Christmas tree, I will do a separate video about it. The next one is an angel topper. This was on sale for 358 pesos. It comes in three sizes, they're small, medium, and this is the large size. It also comes in different colors. I chose silver para neutral siya so I can still use it for other color theme in the coming years. I also bought Christmas LED lights. Last year, white lights yung ginamit ko. For this year, I opted for warm white or yellow for a homey feel. I also got a glittered poinsettia. These are made out of plastic. It was on sale for 79 pesos for 10 pieces. Medyo malit siya compared sa mga glittered poinsettia that you can buy at the mall. And like any other glittered ornaments, medyo na fall off yung mga glitter so you have to be careful if you've got kids or pets at home. The next one is the chiffon petals. This is 110 pesos for 60 pieces. They are all connected on a lace, so I thought of just wrapping it around the Christmas tree. Though unconventional, this is actually multi-purpose, so after Christmas, you can use it for your hair clips or your clothes, curtains, or wherever. There's also the petal lace fabric. 
this was on sale for 75 pesos per yard. I thought of cutting it one by one and putting a string on it to turn it into an ornament. The next are dainty ribbons. This was on sale for 111 pesos for 50 pieces. I'm really not a fan of big ribbons sa mga Christmas tree because I want to be able to see the tree. And since these are small ribbons, I thought it would look cute. The next is a garland. This was on sale for 19 pesos for 2 meters. Medyo manipis siya, but it will be okay for the door. I also bought table covers with Christmas designs for our console tables. This was on sale for 38 pesos each. And last but not the least is a nativity set or a belen. This was on sale for 698 pesos. It comes with built-in Christmas lights and a controller at the back.
There you have it, Dad, Mom, I love you. And for all of you guys who's watching, please um, say I love you to your parents and hug them tight while you still can. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you again on the next video.